Tech Surrey Tin again and how's it going? In this back in this video I'm gonna do another Bat Track 5 tutorial on uh Multi Ego this time. And Multi Ego is a free open source forensics tool. It's an application that helps you gather lots of information about people's networks and even more. Uh it runs on both Windows and Linux. Um I would go into more detail on the all the features, but in this video I'm more aimed at showing you how multi ego works. So, um, multi ego is already pre installed in Backtrack 5. So, I'm going to go ahead and open Backtrack 5 from my VMware uh, Fusion. And I want to go to Applications, Backtrack, Information Gathering, Network Analysis, DNS Analysis, and multi ego. Now, I've already been registered with this. If you have not been registered with this, you have to be registered in order to use it. Uh, it's free to be registered, so all you gotta do is click the blue uh, hyperlink for register here uh, with the setup wizard. And on their site, when you go to the URL, just fill out the, log the information page and then activate it uh, over your email. And then log back in to Multigo the program so um, I'm just gonna go ahead and open a new page you guys will probably already be prompted with a new page um, okay yeah it should say for demo use only is what will pop up and um, I'm gonna go ahead and open this the site over here I think I can click it like there we go and then um, I'm gonna say domain and this is, I'm just messing around here, so um, I'm just going to show you what exactly what this thing does. So um, here, I'm going to change the information, the website. I don't want it to be the site from Multigo. I want to change that. So property view, and I'm going to change the domain name to google.com. Press enter, and now it's changed. And now I'm going to highlight it again. Right click and say um, let's go ahead and say domain owner details from who has information and then you should be listed with uh, information on your this is one entity transform to email address okay so maybe there's some Okay, I don't know exactly what that did, but uh, that actually failed there. I didn't see where that exactly went there. Let's try something else here. Um, let's go ahead and try emails from the uh, at domain, the search engine for Google. There we are. Now um, I can zoom out and in, so I'm going to zoom in so you can see some of this. Some of these emails might be for an admin or something. So that's what you want. Oh, there's one, a DNS admin. And it might even give you some more uh, information on that specific email. Uh, this could be used, you know, for social engineering or whatever you want to do. Um, I mean, if you really wanted to, uh, depending on what, you know, website you're looking at or IP address so you know you can grab emails you can uh, you can run you know a who is you can get DNS names um, you know find DNS names there we go we got some more stuff down here you get servers we got the email server the blog the mail the web uh, SMTP you know that stuff like that so um, I just wanted to show you this tool I thought it was pretty cool it definitely shows I love the graphical f uh, the gra how it shows the graphics because it has a more um, appeal to it instead of just seeing the text do you know what I mean when you're doing a who is in the terminal so instead of you know if you do a who is and then 
google.com you know you're you're gonna get I mean just ex exactly the same stuff or information so you get contact information phone numbers stuff like that so I kinda you know I'm more of using who is than this program I'm more command line based than uh, using you know this program right here I do like it though the graphic if I want to see graphics wise maybe they even show more information than it really does so the DNS admin as you saw his email this is probably his information right here or the whereabouts I mean it may not be exact but this may be a start you know um, you know that's this is exactly what this tool is for so um, it's information gathering so uh, let me know what multi what you guys think about multi ego or this tutorial I mean I'm apologize if you know that I screwed up earlier um, I'm just trying to get the hang of using it in the smaller screen because I cannot uh, full screen backtrack 5 right now uh, it does it screws up in the videos so um, yeah leave your comments uh, let me know what you guys think some of your questions or anything that you may have uh, thanks guys I appreciate it talk to you guys later